Hi, I just want to do a uh, little walk around review of the uh, 14K gooseneck Lone Wolf and Laramore models. Um, both these trailers are as standard as they come off the lot. And uh, so let's get into the review here. Looks like both trailers, or I'll just start off with this one here. I'll review the other one. But uh, this one here has got a 12 inch I beam neck and riser frame. Um, both have breakaway switches, spare tires, um, 3 8 safety chains. Um, in the neck here, you get a breakaway kit in this Lone Wolf model. Um, you got a uh, chain box in the front, a mesh chain box. Hold all your binders and chains and whatnot in there. I believe they both have two uh, 10,000 pound jacks on the drop legs. And you got a step right there you got stake pockets with the rub rail all the way down looks like a 3 8 inch rub rail um the deck on this lone wolf here is made out of angle iron or the top deck has got three inch c channel and angle iron underneath right there so that piece there is angle iron. Mid turn signal light. Two 7K Dexter axle brakes. And your, uh, it's got a slipper spring suspension on it. Walk around to the back of the trailer. Uh, you got a graded dovetail. Uh, and I'll mention the. Uh, Floor is pine, treated pine. Um, you got two, it's like five foot flip over ramps where you can stand them up. Um, the center section on this dovetail pops up only, just the center piece. And uh, other than that, the ramps are spring loaded. You got to step on both sides of the trailer on this one, on this lone wolf. Um, but that's it. You got Dexter axles on this trailer here. And uh, other than that, that is a review of this one here. Going over here to this Laramore. It's a... Uh, 14k gooseneck same as this trailer um you got a uh what's a 20,000 pound or 30,000 pound coupler can't remember spare tire um you know brake box spare tire amount um this trailer here you do have a lockable diamond plate box in the front compared to that trailer you don't it's an option this comes standard um two 10k jacks they are mounted inside the neck on this model which i do not like compared to on this one they're outside which is better um, coming around here, um, some of the differences that I like on the Laramore compared to this trailer hauling at night, lighting wise, um, the front, uh, front light here in the front is, uh, positioned at the corner of the deck compared to where this one is further back. You can't see it at night, so you have no... You can't see your corners of your trailer whatsoever at night. This one you can. You get a step right here. 
um, and a handle there. Um, stake pockets and rub rail on this model. This model made, is made out of C channel. So, if we get up under here, you can see that or not. It's all made out of C channel. Even the cross members made out of C channel. Mid turn signal light there. Um, two of uh, 7K axles on this unit with brakes on both. Um, coming back here, the wood is treated pine. All LED lights on both of these models, I should, I will say. Um, the ramps on this Laramore, you can flip over like I have this or stand them up whichever way. It's got a couple, it's got some bars with it, but uh, you can stand them up with. This whole dovetail here pops up. The whole graded portion pops up on this unit. You can get a pipe with this trailer and uh, and you just kind of flip this back in the hole. There's a, got like a cam type mechanism, I call it. And it just pops this whole dovetail up and it's a straight up flat deck. You get 25 feet of flat deck. Ramps are spring loaded. And uh, other than that, that's it. Um. I do like this layer more, a little bit better, honestly. It's uh, a little bit better made trailer than this lone wolf sitting over here. They both pull amazingly great. But uh, I would probably try this lone wolf out if I if I ever had the chance to buy one. This is not mine. This is a friend of mine's trailer. Let me borrow it. Um, but yeah. Thank you for watching.